kind of feeling like nothing else in this world matters. That's the feeling I get when I'm with you. Whether it be going on a trip to Destin or running to the grocery store, I cherish each and every moment we have together. As your husband, I promise to love you through all of life's moments, to listen to you, to be patient with you, to fight for you, to be your shoulder to cry on, to protect you and to encourage you. I know with our love and respect for one another, we will be able to fight through any of all of life's curveballs. I thank, I thank God each and every day that he led me to you. I'm so excited to see what life has in store for us. I know that it'll be better than anything we could have ever dreamt of. I look forward to a lifetime full of this is my wife Gretchen. What a crazy, beautiful life we've been blessed with. The best is truly yet to come, sweet girl. I love you forever, Gretchen. I'm so glad to be here. Jake, you're more than I could have ever hoped for in a husband. You're the calm to my storm, my soft place to land. You have a heart that shines for miles. Your smile alone makes me want to be a better person. Your voice soothes my soul. You keep me laughing just by being you. Your patience keeps me steady. I pray we go grow old together and for you to still grab my booty in the kitchen. I pray we lean on each other during the hard times and celebrate every success along the way while also enjoying the journey the small things, the every day together. Today I become your wife and promise to love you in every moment. I promise to walk beside you, to fight for you, to encourage you, to listen to you, and to celebrate you the rest of my life. I know with our love, respect, and trust in each other, we will build a life far better than either of us could have ever imagined alone. Jake, my love for you is always. It's my honor to love you, care for you, and share this life together. Even though forever doesn't feel like enough, time with you. I can't wait to share that with you hand in hand. Let's go chase forever because the best is yet to come. <laughs> Love you always. Love brings us together. Love draws us here. Love gives us reason to celebrate. We have gathered in the presence of God to celebrate the love which will become your marriage. The promises which will ever for keep your marriage are rooted in God's love for us. Perhaps there is no greater love than the sacrificial love of Christ. So with his love in mind, we pledge today to sacrifice for one another as we make these promises. have this woman to be your wife, to live together in marriage. Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? If so, say, I will. I will. this man to be your husband, to live together in marriage. Will you love him, honor him, and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others be faithful to him as long as you both shall live? If so, say, I will. I will. I 
as you look forward to what really is the best that's out there before you. Don't forget the best that brought you here. Don't forget the simple laughs and the simple dates before life got complicated that drew you to one another. Don't forget first embraces, you know, and, and long romantic opportunities that reminded you how close you really could be. And don't forget that feeling you had and also you walking toward each other on this day, surrounded by your best friends and surrounded by your family. I think the best is yet to come. Jake. I, Jake. Take you, Gretchen. Take you, Gretchen. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. Hi Gretchen. Take you Jake. Take you Jake. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until we are parted by death. Until we are parted by death. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. I give you this ring. As a sign of my vow. As a sign of my vow. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I honor you. I honor you. I give you this ring. As a sign of my vow. As a sign of my vow. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And all that I had. And all that I have. I honor you. I honor you. Now that Jake and Gretchen have given themselves to one another with their solemn vows, with the joining of hands and the receiving of rings, I announce to you, they are indeed husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. For the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Jake and Gretchen Siebel. All that, I think, uh, made her into the woman she is today, uh, a beautiful, caring, loving uh, woman that she is. Jake, you know that I love you. You know, my best friend, we've shared some great times. I love you, I'm very proud of you, and love you as well, Gretchen, so thanks for everything. 
let's all raise our glass and wish them the best and the best is yet to come. So congratulations. I and we wish you a lifetime of happiness, partnership, and love. So I would want everyone to raise your glass to Gretchen and Jake, and the best is yet to come. Behind every good man is a great woman. Ladies and gentlemen, friends and family, please raise your glass to good men and great women, Jake and Gretchen. <laughs>